In the U.S., people experience 250,000 human bites, 400,000 cat bites, and 4.5 million dog bites each year. Yes, adorable animals can still attack you unexpectedly. Let's take a look at the cutest and fiercest examples. Forget about these viral videos of people hugging pandas. These cuddly-looking cuties can be surprisingly dangerous. Despite cartoonish looks, they're still wild, and they will attack a human when they feel threatened. Even a snow leopard is scared to mess with an adult panda. So if you ever meet this animal in person, keep a healthy distance, especially if it has cubs. Pandas switched from omnivorous to a vegetarian diet a couple of million years ago. But they still have these carnivorous teeth and retractable claws in their paws that can easily cut your skin. Today, scientists speculate that pandas' strict bamboo diet may be contributing to their extinction. So, it makes sense to plant some more bamboo to prevent these fluffy monsters from returning to their carnivorous habits, huh? But let's say you're hiking in the woods in China, and suddenly a ferocious panda jumps out of nowhere. First of all, make sure to carry bear spray and be ready to use it. You can pretend you're not alive, especially if the panda is too big to fight with. Don't rush to run away, though. Instead, try talking to the animal while backing away slowly. If a panda follows you while you're hiking, make loud noises along the trail to scare it away. The smell of food can attract pandas, as well as snow leopards. So avoid cooking if you know you're being stalked. And speaking of deceptive fluff balls, koalas and wombats can't be trusted either. These Australian animals are closest relatives, so they share some common traits. Koalas are territorial creatures, and they don't hesitate to use their sharp claws and teeth to prove it. If a koala starts biting you, it won't let go easily. You'll have to pull it away. So it would be wise to wear long trousers and a jacket to provide additional protection to your skin. Also, make sure to protect your pets, because koalas definitely won't do that. Now, don't be tricked by those cuddly videos of people with koalas, too. These are zoo animals that have gone through a long bonding journey before becoming human-friendly. If you ever come across these creatures in the wild, don't try to take a selfie and avoid triggering them with loud noises. Although koalas are known for sleeping 22 hours a day, it doesn't mean you can't trigger them. Koalas tend to get more alarmed when they detect strangers within a 16-foot radius. By the way, spraying urine on enemies is one of the koala's favorite defense mechanisms. The majority of koalas in the wild can spread unpleasant conditions, so that's another huge reason to stay away from them. Now, wombats may look like innocent, friendly hamsters, but these nocturnal marsupials are known for attacking people, dogs, and even wild dingoes. Yep, they bit several people so badly that they needed hospitalization. So, the safety rules are the same as with koalas. No hugs, no selfies. By the way, if you dare to run away from a wombat, keep in mind it can run up to 25 miles per hour. What about you? Now, take swans. When it comes to personal boundaries, these fancy birds can show some sinister traits, too. Swans can defend their mates and nests very aggressively, which includes biting and even taking your life. Their nesting season between April and June is especially dangerous. So if you're swimming or even walking near a body of water in spring and you spot a sneaky swan coming your way, make sure to keep a respectful distance. You don't want to try to touch or feed them. Don't do anything that can provoke the birds. And heaven forbid you to approach their nests. Beware of the mute swan. It's one of the biggest hooligans in the bird world. These guys are less vocal compared to other swan species, so they can skip warning shouts and simply attack you in total silence. If it happens, don't rush to run away. Instead, try to stay calm, keep on facing the swan, and slowly back away. Using a barrier such as a fence or a tree can be helpful too. You can also trick the swan into believing that you're a bigger bird. Just show them an open umbrella or a wide piece of clothing that imitates wings, if you happen to have it handy. Sometimes you can come across a swan that looks like it needs your help. Even if it breaks your heart, safety rules don't recommend trying to save the bird on your own. That's because the swan may perceive your help as a threat. 
Instead, you should notify local wildlife authorities, and they'll take proper care of the animal. There are many stories of dolphins saving people and being cute and playful. But their games can be surprisingly dangerous, especially in the wild. Even sharks can lose their lives if they mess with the wrong willy. Swimming with these smiley creatures is riskier than you might think. Dolphins can start pushing you with their powerful noses and bodies. In some cases, they can pull you underwater and bite you with their sharp teeth. Unfortunately, not everyone survives such an encounter. So, how do you tell a good dolphin from a sinister one? Well, first of all, if the dolphin is wild, never attempt to feed, pet, or play with it. If you see them flapping their jaws, chasing, slapping their tails in the water, or even releasing clouds of bubbles from their blowholes, take this as a sign of aggression. If you ever find yourself kayaking or swimming in the water with an aggressive dolphin, leave the area as soon as possible. Want to see one of the most poisonous creatures on Earth? Well, here you go! It's hard to resist putting this colorful guy on your palm to take a cute picture. But this could be your last photo shoot. The 2-inch long golden poison dart frog has enough venom to take the lives of 10 healthy adult men. This toxin is meant to attack the predator's nervous system and cause muscle contractions, respiratory paralysis, and even worse. Unlike snakes and scorpions, dart frogs don't need to bite to transfer their venom. They excrete it through their skin glands. So if you ever happen to touch this cutie by mistake, don't rub your eyes and wash your hands immediately. The toxin has to get into your bloodstream to affect you. So if you have any cuts on your skin, it makes sense to go to the hospital as soon as possible. Keep in mind that darts frog skin tends to poison everything it touches, and the toxin can remain on those objects for up to a year. Ah, look at this cute Shrek-eyed toy! Wait a second, it's alive! <laughs> Say hello to one of the few venomous mammals on the planet, the slow loris. It's no wonder that this furry creature is the star of the shadow pet market. But you should read the directions before purchasing it, since a refund is unlikely to be possible. You may have seen this animal raising its hands as if surrendering to the police. Huh, you wish! Slow loris has a toxin released from its bronchial gland on the sides of its elbows. This innocent-looking fluffy takes the venom into its mouth to mix it with its saliva. After that, it can rub its hair with the toxin to scare away its rivals. Or give you a fierce venomous bite that you'll never forget. <laughs> this toxin causes anaphylactic shock, so it's dangerous to human life. Do you still want to bring this cutie home? Nah, I didn't think so. Now, just because the platypus looks like an ancient Pokemon, it doesn't mean you can let your guard down. Male platypuses have a special tool to fight for mates – hidden sharp spurs on their hind feet. They contain a dose of venom that's fatal to a dog-sized animal. But it doesn't mean you're safe. They can attack humans, too. And the sensation caused by the platypus's venom is described as long-lasting intense ache that cannot be relieved with conventional medicines. So never try to pet this cutie, it's not worth it. There are many more cute but vicious animals on the planet, so remember that looks can be deceiving. And stay safe. That's it for today. So hey, if you pacified your curiosity, then give the video a like and share it with your friends. Or if you want more, just click on these videos and stay on the bright side.